I wasn't expecting company, but if you stay out of the shrubs and flower beds, you can stay. Give them a wave, Pops, now that you've invited them in. We're two old guys who enjoy playing sandbox and survival games together. I'm Uncle Craig. Go ahead and sit down. Let's visit for a while. Again, we uh, are going back five blocks. I should probably look around once in a while. You just never know when a creeper's going to happen up on you. You may not be able to tell exactly what I'm doing here, but I'm kind of learning a little bit on how to switch tools using my number buttons instead of using the mouse wheel. I've become so accustomed to using the mouse wheel through the years. And it actually speeds things up quite a bit. So I'm switching back and forth between the pickaxe and the shovel right when I know I need to. Oh, somehow I switched position of my <laughs> of my um, axe and pickaxe. Yeah, see, so getting used to how to switch them. And we're breaking the surface now. Ah, come on. Now we need a pickaxe. Boy, do we need a pickaxe. More coal. Can't hurt to have coal. For one thing, you get experience for it. So we're going to mine this out, even though it's not part of our excavation. We're going to mine it out because it's nice to have ore. Uh, coal ore. There are times also when coal and iron are found together. Now it's more in the past than it is in the most recent versions of Minecraft, but it's still, I find, uh, can hold true. All right, so let's get rid of this, and this, uh, and that. That block's gonna be removed too. I just didn't ever get this far, I guess. Just to get this outside edge here. There we go. Hey, oh, come on, get up there. Clear this out. All right. Making short work of this. Okay, now let's get this stone out of here. And we have some more coal. Now we won't be able to do the full automated sorting till we have visited the, uh, the nether. So we'll make a trip over there at some point. Get some crystals. Use those for the, ah, good grief. We use those for the comparators. Everything else we can get from here. Redstone, iron, um, wood. I don't know if there's anything else we need. Got almost three game hours left until the next day. We'll keep going till 5 p.m. 1700 hours then we'll dive back into the mine shaft finish mining out that third level down and then i will be measuring out kind of what we'll need for the um for the fully automated storage system so we're going to begin projects like that by considering what the end game is what we're going to need at the end of end of getting everything in place and we're going to build out whatever we build out with that in mind begin with the end in mind stephen covey said i think with seven habits of highly effective people and the software engineering principle dependency inversion says begin with the most dependent part of your system and work your way back all right and it's almost five we'll get a little bit of this dirt here all right that's good enough Go back down, run back here, put this in the storage that's back here. And I think I want to take, see, we don't have wood in there. Let's go up a level and see what we have available for logs. We have nothing here. And really, boy, we got to get the farm going i thought we had some logs stored away we're going to um take about a oops about a quarter of that i'm not sure what that does so i'm not going to do it and then we'll take this stack and make it into sticks and uh, we have plenty of ladders but i just i wanted to get lots of sticks i guess i got way more than i needed that's all right though down a level and we'll keep mining this out I don't know where I left off. Looks like I left off right there. There we get our extra iron. And we're into day 17 now, of course. Oh, now I got water coming in. 
Uh, now, where that's coming in from, I don't... That's just a source block. Hey, good. We were needing a source block so I could pick up some water. There we go. That block right there. Like, subscriber, get off my lawn. Uh, there's There were blocks all surrounding it, so it was just a pocket of water. That's kind of cool. Uh, there's another one. Huh, I wonder... I'm going to use that gravel to fill that in for now. Yeah, I'm not sure how that got in there, but, uh, oh well. Maybe when we, oh, you know what? When we built that up, that level above us out, we probably uh, trapped some water in there. So that's very likely what's going on. We may get more. It's fine. Uh, let me get a, there's granite. Let's just use that for now. And diorite. We'll just use the diorite. And let's get this out of the way. Okay. Oh. Uh, did I destroy it? And I misplaced my axe again. See? <laughs> Can't. I'm, getting, I'm figuring it out. How to switch between tools. And do it without switching my tools. If that makes sense. Ah, uh, come on. Ah, uh, come on. Here we go. Old dogs can learn new tricks, but it takes a little extra time for them to become proficient at them. Let's make sure we don't accidentally mine out that column where the stairs are. All right, so that's done. And uh, we can start on this section here. Okay, only two o'clock. Let's, uh, oh, we got a couple. At least one hole in the ceiling. Got that sealed up. There's more iron. That's good. Got about an hour and a half left here. Game time. Okay, five o'clock in the morning. Set up here. We'll deposit what we picked up in there. There's a lot from the room above that will also go in that chest. That you know, a lot of stuff that's similar. We can pack it all in one chest. We'll leave them separated for now. Uh, we got the copper in there. Let's see if we've got... There it is. Look at that. We got eight iron, which is perfect. One coal will smelt eight iron. And I think we have all of our armor. 